the hell? Is there a cicada here? Don't play with me. Oh my God, I start residency literally in like less than a month. I mean, that's crazy. Wow, I can't even believe my how the tables have turned. Milkshakes, boozy milkshakes. Oh shit, I forgot, I'm excited now. <laughs> Spending time with yourself is one of the best ways that you can spend your time. What's up everybody? It's my Michelle and I'm back with another video. Today we are doing a vlog, a situation, and today is going to be a good day because I have some things that I have to do um, that I plan on doing later today and that I want to bring you guys along and it's going to be fun. We're going to talk. Right now it's the morning time, so right now all I'm really doing or all I'm about to do is just finish up some paperwork. I'm not really going to film any of that because there's really no point. Like I'm sure you guys do not crave to watch me do busy work. So I just have some paperwork I have to do for my work that I'm starting. Actually, oh my God, in like three and a half weeks. Oh my God. I start residency literally in like less than a month. I mean, that's crazy. Wow. I can't even believe my how the tables have turned. Wow. How amazing is that, that I'm actually doing this, you know? Because I have said for so many years, you know, I want to be a doctor, I want to be a doctor, blah, blah, blah. And, like, the fact that I'm actually now a doctor and, like, I can go into the training of my specialty, like, that is amazing. Like, I can't believe this is happening. <laughs> I just literally had an epiphany just now. Amazing. But anyway... I have to do busy work so everything is squared away when I start residency so I have to do all this like crazy paperwork it's like actually crazy so I know nobody wants to see me do that so when I'm done I will hop back on here and we can spend the day like do fun things things that you actually want to see we can do that together but before we go any further if you are returning to my channel welcome back Mwah. so happy to have you here so glad to see you if you are new to my channel hey girl welcome there is a subscribe button that you can click if you so choose i get it though sometimes you need to know if this person that you're subscribing to like do you really want to see what they have to offer are you cool are they cool people i do the same thing when youtubers ask me as a viewer to subscribe to their channel so i totally understand the hesitancy i totally understand if you feel like this is a decision that you really need to think about and make so how about this watch the video all the way through make a decision or you could go to my channel and you can look at the other videos that i have uploaded and you can decide for yourself if this is something that you want to do make the right decision for you and if so click the subscribe button there will always be a place for you here next make sure you follow me on my social media because there are things that i do on there that i just don't do on here also make sure that you check out the description box below. I'm doing this new thing now where anybody who comes to my channel and happens to look at the description box, I wanna make sure that there is something in there that you, know, you can actually use or can benefit you or somebody else. So what I've done is I have a whole entire list of small, and when I say small, I mean very small black creatives. Very small, meaning like me. Doesn't really have a large following, things like that. So if you check out the description box, then you'll see that whole entire list. So check out those small black creatives. Expand your horizons. You know, there's enough love and wealth to spread and go around. So check out the description box. Okay, so now that all that's out of the way, I'm going to go ahead and get to work and... Um, I will catch you when I get, when I finish this. I will hop back on when I finish all my busy work. Hey everyone. So I just went to the grocery store cause I just needed to pick up like, like some vegetables, but that's about it. Um, now I'm back and I am going to go for a walk now. Um, it's a beautiful day outside. It's hot. Um, I'm dressed. Well, I'll do a little OOTD when I get to the elevator to go downstairs, but I, oh, I hope I'm not blocking the mic. It's beautiful outside. Like 
where I live, there's like a beautiful trail and beautiful paths and like a creek with lots of trees and it's really nice out. I just hope that, you know, the cicadas are, are here. So I really hope that like none fly on me because I will turn right around and go home. Okay, don't play. But this is the bag I'm taking. It's probably really stupid that I'm wearing all black and I'm carrying a black backpack, but I'm realizing I don't have any other t-shirts. Oh, well, I do. You know what? I could wear a sports bra. I don't know. But anyway, so I have my water bottle here. I have a little face towel for like, you know, if I get really sweaty, um, I can wipe my face. I have an umbrella just in case it rains. The weather has been like weird lately, but... Um, just in case I have my tripod because I do want to take some pictures and stuff while I'm out um, I have this water that I got from Whole Foods I don't really like it but I'm gonna drink it it's this was expensive it was like three dollars and it's like an electrolyte water and it's cucumber watermelon I don't really like it I don't recommend it uh, they have other flavors but I don't know and then I brought myself some strawberries. So we're going to get it ready to head out. The only thing I need to get are my sunglasses, actually. I need to go to my car first before we continue and venture outside. So we have the OO TV. White sneakers. I should wear different shoes, but too late. Black biker shorts. A top with a message. It's my body, it's my choice. I don't know if you can read that. It's backwards, probably. Honestly, you guys, good thing I didn't get on the elevator because I definitely forgot my AirPods. That would have been a disaster. A disaster. Okay, I found my AirPods. Like, they were randomly, like, not anywhere where i like would have thought to look so i mean i'm glad i found them but whew, i need to do better at keeping up with these uh i don't know how much battery is left will it come up on the screen <gasps> two percent oh my god okay so i googled it and it said that i have about five hours of listening time on a single charge so I think I'm okay until I mean, I'm certainly not gonna be walking around for five hours <laughs> maybe two but like five I mean that's just ridiculous <sighs> you guys the cicadas literally are everywhere Ugh, I have to like watch where I step because I could step on one and I just hate like oh like the crunching sound <laughs> oh look at a beautiful bird you know one thing about um the dc area so i'm from michigan and i love michigan i think michigan is a great place to live um detroit is a great place if you've never been you should definitely visit one day in your life um it's great but um like I was saying, when I moved to D.C. about four years ago, like D.C. and um, the greater D.C. area, so like parts in um, Maryland and Virginia, are very, very liberal, very progressive. Like I see Black Lives Matter signs everywhere, rainbow flags, stuff like that just a really great progressive city and environment and I really love that about this area I really love it here moral of the story <laughs> in conclusion <laughs>
I've been walking for about an hour now and um, I am just getting ready to take a break. I walked this trail once before and I honestly do not remember like any of this at all. So like I am just out here, you know? <laughs> It's like I'm walking this for the first time. I would say that the first time I did walk this, these trails was about two years ago. So, hey, I guess it's plenty of time for you to forget a whole bunch of stuff. I was thinking about bringing my journal, but then I was like, what am I going to do? Like, bring my journal and sit on a rock and, like, write? No, that's uncomfortable. But I didn't know there was benches and there's a picnic table right there. We're going to have a treat. I'm still in the process of like finding a home for residency. You are definitely going to see a vlog about that. Um, I'm not really sure which one's going to go up first. Probably this one. I'm not sure though. Don't quote me. <laughs> you know, <clears throat> I think spending time with yourself is one of the best ways that you can spend your time. Whether that's being like doing a solo trip or just going on a walk by yourself, like what I'm doing today, um, going to a museum, going to a movie by yourself, like me personally, I consider spending time with myself like true self care because when you get to that point where you love spending time with yourself and like you truly enjoy your company. I feel like that's next level, you know, like that is truly a level of like, I love me. That's like a whole different level of in, uh, intimacy that you're spending with yourself. And I think when you enjoy your own time by yourself, you don't crave or feel like you need time with other people to be meaningful. I always would spend time with myself. Um, I always took myself on dates, like before the pandemic, I would always go to the movies by myself. And um, I would always go to like a specific movie theater. Uh oh, what the hell? Is there a cicada here? Don't play with me. I could have sworn I heard a cicada. But anyway, I would go to like a very specific movie theater and that was like a good two hours by myself and if i really really wanted to like treat myself i would get like my favorite food from my favorite restaurant we're all humans and we definitely crave social interaction i am by no means an introvert i'm absolutely an extrovert and i love um being social but i also am able to do anything that I can do with another person I can do with myself but the real test was when I was for my 25th birthday I was basically forced to do a solo trip because I planned a trip with um three of my friends they all dropped out some two of them dropped out like last minute like I already bought my chicken and booked the hotel and everything everything was paid for so that forced me to go out on a limb and just go and it was the best time i've ever had in my life and i think solo trips are definitely a way that you can definitely get to know yourself and spend time with yourself and have a great time but that's like not even that's like diving head first into the deep end if you really want to like get your toes wet and like you know just gradually step in and like get to that point eventually like things like this are really nice you can take yourself on walks you can take yourself to the movies you can take yourself out to dinner you can go to a bookstore or a library all of those things are great ways to just get to know yourself and really be comfortable with spending time with you so cheers i'm gonna enjoy my strawberries okay we have had our snack we have hydrated and it's probably about four it's probably after 4 30 and my hunger is going to creep up on me i'm pretty sure it's dinner time so we are going to 
pack up and head back and probably make some dinner. Yeah, I will see you at home. Look at the deer. Hi, deer. Oh no, he's going away. So, change of plans. We are um, clearly in a different outfit. We are dressed and we are going to actually head into the city. I told my friend that I would go out to dinner or lunch with her tomorrow. That was the plan, but she called me and she was like, hey, can we switch? Can we actually go out today and not tomorrow? And I was like, sure, why the hell not? So this is from Fashion Over the Top. I don't know what the name of it is called. Um, oops, rip that. The jeans are from Forever 21. I got these a long time ago. Um, they used to be extremely loose fitting. Now they're kind of tight. Well, they're not tight. They actually fit like pretty good. All right, let's hit the road, friends. Capital Burger. That's where we're headed with Dorian. It's going to be some good eats today. They have delicious burgers and milkshakes, boozy milkshakes. Oh shit, I forgot. I'm excited now. <laughs> <laughs> burger I added bacon and I got the Brussels sprouts they were three dollars extra I feel like health shouldn't cost you extra but whatever Dorian got the same thing she got the Brussels sprouts she basically got the same yeah we got the same order basically. I didn't put bacon in mine oh yeah she got no bacon in her Brussels sprouts but I got bacon baby I love bacon I decided to get some ice cream uh-oh she checked the parking. That's what I thought. It's a loading zone. No! Okay, back to the drawing board. I'm back home now it was an abrupt transition but that's okay because Dorian she didn't really want to be filmed like that she she tried with me in the beginning but then she was like all right we're done here and I said okay I had to respect that so it's about what time is it it's about 10 20 p.m. and I am winding down you know usually I'm like out cold by now like yesterday I went to bed at like 9 what 9 45 9 30 last night I was out cold this is the end thank you for coming with me thank you for enjoying my walk with me 
And I hope that that inspires you to spend some time with yourself and, you know, really get to know yourself. So I, I hope that sparks something in you to be able to do that. Bye, guys. Have a great night. Have a great day. Have a great afternoon, evening, whenever you're watching this. I hope you have a great time and I will catch you in my next video. Bye.